Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to another vlog. Today I just wanted to catch up with y'all, show you around the house, kind of show you the kitchen. I also have a wedding. Well, I have a wedding in May, but I have two weddings in July. So I got a ton of wedding dress options of Revolve. I spent so much money. So hopefully like one works out and the rest are getting returned. But I'll do a little Revolve try on haul in today's video and just a bunch of things. Basically kind of like a house tour because our house has changed so much. Not just the kitchen, but like our entire downstairs area. And yeah, I think that's my intro. So let's get into today's vlog. Y'all, for the first time since March, our kitchen is tidy and looking clean. I'm just feeling so much better because I feel like it's been so chaotic here. Everything looks so messy and things were so out of place. So today I took matters into my own hands. It's about 90% done. We had some drama that I'll tell you all about in a bit, but I'm so happy and so clean. I'm obviously taking advantage of Olivia's nap time to clean this, but just feel very content. It's like Sunday morning. I already got this done and checked off my list. And like one of these days, I'll definitely do a little organization vlog where I show like kind of where we're gonna rearrange or arrange and organize our kitchen because obviously now we have way more storage and things like that, but I'm so happy right now. I guess I can show you this right now. <laughs> so this is the current situation. As y'all know, our garage is our master bedroom and the plan is just to close this down and have our kind of like master suite connect to the house however this is not foundation this is just concrete so in order for us to actually build like what we want to build we have to first of all even it out it was pretty uneven and it would always flood so they're removing the concrete and then we're moving this back porch to the back of the garage please ignore my neighbors decided to the fence at the same week that we're doing this um so yeah they're they just started they're supposed to come today i don't know if they are it's like about to be 11 and they haven't come so i don't know but then they're doing the other half and then they're going to level it to the garage which will prevent it from flooding ever again knock on wood um so all our stuff is there but it's exciting because we got to get rid of a bunch of things hello chaotic boys and girl um and this is what our room looks like right now messy 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 so this rug was originally in our living room so it's going back there i need to deep clean it i just got the most amazing carpet cleaner from amazon you'll see her benny hi benini okay so here it is and you know what's weird on camera it looks so much more neutral and this is what it looks like on the amazon listing i guess i can put it on the screen that's what it looks like right but in person it's literally green i don't see myself taking this to ups though so we'll see what my husband says if he likes it okay i made the bed so we can get a full what's going on over there <laughs> bolt okay i have a few things to say i made the bed so we can get like a full picture olivia of course woke up and also penny is covered in these little green things that she keeps dropping everywhere because we have a lot of bad um weeds i guess in english it's just weeds but in spanish it's yerba mala anyway okay now what do we think we like we don't like tell me everything please i don't know how i feel about it i mean i definitely like it on camera but in person it's green i don't know what's going on hi penny this is such a cute picture skibby Oh, little puppies posing for mommy. Cuties. Hello. Hi. Hi. Oh my goodness. What a pretty girl. Hi. <laughs> oh my goodness. Look at the lashes. It's funny. What are you doing? Hi. Can you say hi? <laughs> oh, I have so much to tell y'all. Last time I was having like a straight up mental breakdown now i could still have one but things are going so much better <laughs> so she's eating her food again um we went with the generic brand of the infamil gentle ease she's been eating so so good look at those chunky chunky arms and we finally transitioned her to sleep on her own in her own room in her own crib she's out of the garage so she's not sleeping with us anymore 
and it's been going so so well um knock on wood <laughs> she's crawling up a storm so we gotta baby proof this house because the girl is a little menace <laughs> little menace girl little menace girl oh also i got lash extensions the house is coming together i have lots of things to show y'all it's been hard for me not really hard for me it's just like difficult for me to manage my time because sometimes it's just easier to do a little transformation tiktok over on my instagram rather than like a whole vlog but i've been you know working on decorating cleaning organizing the house so i wanted to just show you all around today our living room was actually super organized but i had to take off the clothing from the dryer to dry more stuff so that's why that's there but here's what the living room looks like Obviously, this corner is completely messy, but what do y'all think? I think it looks pretty good. So we change the curtain rods and the curtains. I did long curtains and we pulled them up and then those are from Amazon. It came in a two pack. I'll link them and we are needing to mount the anthropology mirror because even though it's so heavy i'm just really scared with olivia crawling and walking um that anything could happen i know it won't but just just to be safe i want to mount it on the wall um so yeah this new coffee table is from target i love it and then the rug is back here and then we have our little cabinet also target um that this really needs to be styled differently but who cares and then here's a better look of my little dress i can't find my strapless bra and my sticky boobs are doing something weird to my boobs so here's my outfit with the chloe sandals i need to self tan really bad because i look so pale but let's go i still feel like i look pretty chunky i need to work out let's go Okay, something that is incredibly incomplete is our dining room. Here's what I got so far because I do need to go eat lunch. I know, I know, I'm aware of the rug situation, okay? But like, what do y'all think? How could this be better? Obviously, I need to paint the walls. It is the next day, actually. Maybe a few days since I last updated y'all, but I wanted... First of all, I look so much better. When I was wearing that pink Abercrombie dress, my hair was so gross. My nails were very gross, so I'm glad we're back. Anyway, I have an update. Uh, we got a new rug. We got a light fixture that kind of doesn't work, but I'll talk about that another day. Um, the rug is from Amazon. What do we thinky? Definitely better than that ugly black and white rug that we had. Um, what do we think? Do you like it? Because I love it. And y'all know I usually don't love dark things. Let me show you better. You don't need to see my face. As you can probably see, the light fixture doesn't really work because it's missing like a piece. So it's not really in there that well. It's also a little too big. Um, no one told my husband that because he really wanted it and it's also meant for like higher taller ceilings and we just don't have that but he wanted it and you know what i will lose this one because <laughs> i've won every other one um it's from target i'll link it but basically these rods right here were white like a stark white and to me they look weird um so i spray painted them without asking anyone and they look so much better in my opinion it's from the studio mcgee line i actually got a ton of different light fixtures from the target line because they were all 50 percent off so we can finally replace this one and they just haven't come in anyway so the rug is amazon i think it's beautiful and it adds a little more like dimension to all this like very very light wood i'm still like struggling to decide if i even like these chairs with this table but you know what i'm not gonna get into that right now anyway um and then i put the anthropology mirror back where it belonged actually let me get close anyway this is besides the point but you know i have adhd look at my new amazon shorts that are legit like the free people ones but 20 bill <laughs> that was not english 20 dollars less 
y'all so cute so many colors i did a try on haul but i tried on the medium black and these are like a really fun cobalt blue in the size small they fit so much better and today we finally don't have any employees in this house um like doing construction or remodels or anything so i can finally wear my favorite clothes to wear but obviously i can't wear that with a bunch of men here um that was a tangent anyway i've won too many to argue with my husband about one stupid light fixture i'm aware it's too big okay anyway um what was i gonna say oh, i got these cutie plates from h&m look how adorable i need to get two more because i only got four h&m has my heart and then last house related update it rained for less than a day it was like three hours and this whole thing flooded it looked like a straight up pool now everything's muddy and as you can see from all those little doggy paws you can imagine how muddy our bedroom is and how muddy everything is so i need to get this done asap it's just like it's not even that i don't want to it's the fact that we need to get the plumbing in order in the exact place where our bathroom is gonna go and there's just so much that goes into that like the sewage line and all this stuff um that just is really slow which sucks because obviously i don't want to have this whole muddy rocky situation in my backyard but i literally have no other option right now hi you say hi Hello. You got both. I'm making Olivia some lunch. This is lentil pasta and then celery, spinach, and peas. <coughs> I almost choked to death with one of these. This is my healthy snack. It's literally like chicken tenders. <laughs> um, but they're so quick and easy and they taste so good. So yeah, that's what we're doing. Okay, homegirl ate. <laughs> She's wearing a cutie beachy outfit. Are we going to the beach? No. Um, I thought I would do the try on haul now. Not sponsored, not super obsessed with the quality of anything for everything to be so expensive. Let me show you the options. I'm out of breath, I just ran up the stairs with her and with this thing. So let's see how long she lets me try on dresses for. I have no words for what's going on now. We're starting off so strong. Obviously, like, I'm wearing the wrong bra slash shapewear. But, I mean, I'm only 4'11", so maybe this would be more flattering on, like, a taller person. But is this necessary? <laughs> like, the little... I don't even know what this looks like. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, the back is supposed to be open. Not for me. Let's just leave it at that. Just simply not for me. The socks really tie it in though. Okay, I got this one in two colors. Um, this color is alright. It's like too close to my skin tone. Planning on getting a spray tan, obviously, for all of these. Like, all the weddings. But, my problem is the fupa, like, shows too much. Even though I'm literally wearing, like, spandex underneath. And I don't know if like the cowl neck situation is like super flattering on my chest. I think this is by far the best one. It is the same as that champagne colored one, but in navy. This thing is more flattering. However, I do still see like a lot going on here just because of where this hits. If I was taller, it maybe would hit a little bit higher. Like I said, I could get it altered, but I like it. Um, once again... Same issue with the cowl neck. I don't know if it's the most flattering, but I'm sure I could work with it. I don't know. So far, this is like the best one out of the bunch, and I still don't love it, you know? So, it's a problem. I'm so sad because this color is so, so pretty, but as you can see, because of my boobs, it literally won't close. I could get it altered, maybe. I hate having big boobs when I'm short, y'all. I really do. But this color, though, is like the prettiest one. Okay, before y'all say anything, number one, I do match my rug perfectly. Number two, I asked the bride to choose a bunch of dresses, and this is one of the ones she liked. So, let's not say anything about the color, but I just don't think, like, the train would be fun. I think the one shoulder is not really what I'm looking for, and I legit have a dress from Princess Polly that was less than 60 bucks. <laughs> this exact same material and quality so i could never justify keeping something like this i also think 
it's just not the vibe, you know? I do love the color. But this was such a fail, y'all. I cannot believe. Like, all of this was like $1,000. I'm almost done. I hate it, too. Um, and everything is just, like, the quality's not great. So, I couldn't recommend it less. Maybe it's my body type. Maybe it's just me and my choices. But not obsessed with a single thing that I got. I am not going to lie to y'all. That um, try and haul almost sent me into, like, a spiral of body confidence and then i was like you know what it's on me it's these dresses and if my stomach looks like that it's because i have a baby and who cares so i won't go down that spiral but i do want a little bit of advice or help or something so i got this cutie little bag off of maggie's catalog there must be a better way to show you but let me show you this Ignore the boxes. I am packing up the returns as we speak because I'm so mad. Anyway, um, obviously I'm wearing the wrong outfit, but I love the size. I love that it's white. It's so cute. But look how weirdly long the strap is and it's not adjustable. Like it hits me right there and I just feel like that is not very cute. Like if anything, if it were to hit me like right at my hip, it'd be better just don't love where it hits like the chain and I guess I could get a different chain because it's so freaking cute y'all it's like $89 if y'all want like screenshot this and send it to her um so y'all can get it and it comes in different colors but I'm so sad because I feel like it doesn't look good like the length on the chain let me know what y'all think if you have any suggestions I know Amazon sells replacement chains that I could do but besides that it's adorable here's a better look I think it's really cute that's what the back looks like now let me open it to show y'all I usually don't love her Gucci items like the ones from her regular store but these are very very good quality I love it if only like the chain fit better or if it was adjustable but isn't this the cutest bag ever now I'm obsessed with white bags all thanks to my friend um, the girl that's getting married she asked me to find her some white bags of DH gate so I did and now I got this one and it's so cute and I feel like white bags would go with everything literally so now I want to get more but let me know if y'all have any tips this is what the chain looks like so you can't really adjust it I was trying to see if here we could but no okay well just let me know anyway I'm gonna go ahead and end off the vlog here number one because it's really long and number two because I want to post it today so I need to do a better job at vlogging but knock on wood may will be super fun when it comes to vlogs because i have a lot of things planned and yeah i cannot wait to show you guys everything thank you guys so much for watching as always i love you guys so so much i'll talk to you guys very soon in my next one